Welcome back to the Whiskey Couch here in Pretoria, South Africa. My name is Gustav Muller and this is Whiskey Tasting and Food Pairing Review number 114. Before I get to today's whiskey, just a reminder that in the notes of this video, just below the video, you will find an extensive list that I've put there of some of the other whiskey tubing channels, all of which I have subscribed to, not only because I have a great respect for all of those guys, but also because I learn a lot from them. You can never get to a point where you know everything. So I enjoy other reviews. I learn a lot just as I think I know something, then I learn something new. So I would encourage you have a look at those channels and maybe you want to subscribe to some of those as well. Today's whiskey, the second in this series that I'm doing on Inch Morin expressions from the Loch Lomond distillery. This particular one for today is the Inch Morin Madeira Wood Finish. Yesterday I reviewed the 12 year old from the Loch Lomond distillery and I did give yesterday some detail and background on the Loch Lomond distillery so today it is straight to the whiskey. Inchmorin is the um, island collection from the Loch Lomond distillery and it got its name from the biggest of the 50 islands in the Loch Lomond which is also called Inchmorin so that's where it gets its name from and this particular expression, a no age statement, got a gold medal at the 2016 San Francisco Spirit Competition. This is the gift box, and there you can see the island, Ishmaran Island, in the Loch Lomond, and a lot of information on the gift box. So, no age statement, bottled at 46%, same as yesterday's 12 year old, 46% right there. And of course here in South Africa, 750 milliliters or 75 centiliters. Single malt scotch whiskey, distilled, matured and bottled in Scotland, the island collection, non-chill filtered. And it says here with an orchid fruit character and a long dry nutty finish. So I've already poured my jam before I started the video just to give it time to settle. That is always important, especially if you working with a whiskey that is a few years old 12 18 21 years old then they say the rule of thumb is to let it stand for a minute for every year that it's old so here we go inch modern madeira wood finish a deep gold color the same as the 12 year old Oh, sweet notes on the nose, but different than the 12 year old. This is more a sweet wine and very distinctively the Madeira wood matured in ex-bourbon casks and then finished in Madeira casks from Portugal. Madeira sweet wine is a fortified sweet wine from Portugal and very distinctive the influence of that those sweet wine barrels that it was matured in, sweet wine casks. Yeah, sweet, sweet wine, overripe grapes. But also a bit of honey and brown sugar. Nutty almonds. Nutmeg. Quite a nice nose, but yesterday with a 12 year old that was an extremely good nose that I experienced yesterday. Mm. Mm. 
very different than Yesterani. The sweet raisins and the toffee. Mmm. Butterscotch honey. And a little bit of orchid fruits, but then also the slight bitter notes. Oak tannins and the dryishness on the finish. So sweet fruits and nuts with a dryish finish, but a quite a long finish. It's just lingering. Mmm. Staying with me. A bit of chocolate notes on the palate. What fruits am I getting? Pear, a bit of pear. Pears and peaches. Mmm. Wonderful and a nutty. The nutty flavors, almond flavors. Martipan. Martipan flavors. I'm quite impressed with the Inch Morin range from the Loch Lomond distillery. I think I prefer this range before the Loch Lomond range. So very impressed so far. Yesterday with the 12 year old and today with the Madeira finish. Long finish that I'm experiencing. Still some of the fruity sweetness. The white, the sweet wine sweetness. And the bitter chocolate. And the nuttiness. So now I've added a few drops of water. Just to see what the effect will be. So you can see the reaction of the water. Mmm. Yes, just more sweet wine and more brown sugar. Mm. More raisins. More chocolate. But I almost want to say not to add water to this particular one. It was very good before I added the water. So my summary would be, yes, my summary would be sweet raisins and chocolate. This That's my summary for this Madeira with Finnish expression, part of the Inch Morin range. But the 12-year-old from yesterday is still my favorite. The price here in South Africa, around 600 Rand, South African Rand. About 50 pounds in the UK and uh, I couldn't find a US dollar price but it will probably be around $60 more or less. If you want to pair this whiskey, sweet wine finish whiskey with a food snack, then I would recommend that you connect with the raisins, the fruitiness, the chocolate or the nutty almond marzipan notes in the flavor profile. So, I am going to try the marzipan. This is a picture of what marzipan typically looks like. This is the packaging that I got it in. I can remember my mother used to love marzipan. It is a sweet that's made of almond paste. And uh, I think it's the other ingredients are honey and egg, egg white or something. And... And sugar, I'm not sure, but the main ingredient is the almond, almond paste. And I've got some slices that I've prepared for this tasting and pairing. But you can also try chocolate covered raisins will go well. Or honeyed goat's cheese on crackers will work well. Or even fruit and nuts. I'd recommend all of those. But let's see if the marzipan... Works. So it's a dark chocolate covered marzipan. So this will connect with the chocolate notes in the flavor profile of the whiskey and also the almond nutty notes. Mm. Mm.
wonderful the almond nuttiness and the dark chocolate mm. I must say this is an exquisite pairing I prefer the look the inch modern 12 year old from yesterday as a as a whiskey but this pairing is extremely good so i prefer this pairing yesterday's pairing was like a four out of five this is definitely a four and a half out of five fantastic pairing wonderful adventure thank you for watching and uh, i look forward to seeing you again tomorrow for the last in this series of three inch modern expressions that i am reviewing slanger